we're gaining confidence from the data that between 5 and 30% of persons with COVID-19 will experience some form of long COVID. Uh, whether high or low, short or long term, these health consequences represent a substantial impact on our patients, but also a substantial impact on our healthcare system. Third, this report is the first time that we've collected all the research that's happening, and it really is significant, all the research that's happening in one place, looking at the gaps, and we have worked to create a cohesive path to move forward. Can we expect to see more funding of research in this area? Well, we are hopeful uh, that there will be more research for funding by the NIH, by the CDC, by the VA, by the private sector uh, as, as well. So we are hopeful that there will be more funding for this research.